Well, Nigel Burton, Lincoln Kennedy here with you at the Washington Spring Preview with the man of the day, Alex <laughs> Cook. Hey, man, congratulations, man. Great job. Uh, you know, he's from Sacramento, so he must be a baller, Lincoln. Oh, my God. Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> must be a baller. Hey, hey, take me through. Had a great play, great interception uh, of Michael Penix Jr. in the corner, man. Take me through that play today, man. W what, a, what a great job today. Man, I appreciate that. Thank you guys for the interview. And I just want to say, man, we've been we've been grinding all all spring. Uh, we've been watching a bunch of film, and I've been really trying to focus in on the on the splits of the receivers and who's on the ball. And that's kind of what I recognized in that play. I noticed that number three was on the ball, and and uh, they showed all spring that that number three receiver runs the deep route. So I'm anticipating either him running a post or a corner route. And sure enough, he ran the corner route, broke on it, anticipated it, and got away with the pick. Alex, all we've heard in the offseason is how much you guys are anticipating and waiting for the next season and a new opportunity oh, yeah. to reestablish ourselves. So the question that I have for you right now is, are you having fun after the spring, uh, the spring day and spring game? Oh, we're having so much fun. I mean, the, com the camaraderie has been second to none. Uh, we built so many great relationships with the coaches. And that's really all the spring, spring camp was about, which is building a relationship with the coaches and building trust and that camaraderie with, amongst one another. And we're going to carry that into the offseason with the strength coaches, and then we're going to carry that into fall camp and in the season we go. Well, Alex, you got a chance uh, this week to see two of your uh, former dogs now make it on to the NFL with uh, Trent McDuffie yeah, moving on. Yeah, and, my boys. <laughs> yes, sir. And then Kyler Gordon going in the second round. I mean, what does the DB tradition here at UW mean oh, to you? Yeah, man, it's, yeah, oh my gosh. It's just something you dream about your whole life. I mean, death row, DBU, all that kind of stuff. So. When I first came to college, obviously I came in as a receiver, but I was always looking on the other side of the ball like, man, it would be so awesome to be on that side of the ball, be with that DB crew and continue that legacy. And when I made the switch, that's all I wanted to do. And seeing the Elijah Moldens, the Keith Taylors, the Byron Murphys, and now Trent and Kyler go to NFL, get drafted, man, it's a, it's so inspirational. It's amazing to see. And, and, that's, and that's what I'm trying to get out of my guys right now. That, that that could be us. We just got to put in the work, and they already got the they already set the blueprint. We just got to follow what they do. Well, before you do all that stuff, man, we're gonna look forward to seeing all the big things you're gonna do for the Huskies this next fall. But uh, Alex, we appreciate you joining us, man. Keep doing your thing and keep representing Sacramento. We appreciate oh, yeah. you. Oh yeah, baby, nine one six. Thank you guys. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, appreciate Alex it. Cook, defensive back for the Euro Washington Huskies.